Alright you guys, just want to show you a couple of great lures for peacock bass. In case you want to catch your first topwater peacock bass or you've just been struggling to catch a peacock bass on topwater. Basically, first one I'm going to show you, you can use it right out of the box, is the teeny popper. The one I use in the video, oh it's on my rod right now, but anyway, it's similar to this one but it's the cream. I'll get it for you right now actually, hang on. Alright you guys, the company is called Cream. This is the, the lure I used from Cream. Got this one online from eBay. That one's been working and or you can just go with the with the Rebel Teeny Popper. I've had luck with this one here. This is a two inch. You wanna go with the small ones, you'll get a little probably a little more action. And the other one is the the Rebel Minnow. I'm going to show you a modification you're going to have to do to this lure to keep it top water. And I'll show you that right now. And then, anyway, we fished um, fished yesterday, and then today is just downpouring. It's Sunday. Uh, and the Rebel Minnow is basically the same one with the lip. And all I did was remove the lip to make it top water, like this one here. Pretty simple mod, and the lure will get them up. I got one with this lure, but I wasn't recording, so I couldn't show you that footage. But I wanted to do a video with the same exact lure that I modified. But I did end up catching one, just like I said, the camera wasn't recording. All right, you guys, enjoy the video. I also did some jerk bait fishing uh, with this one here, and then uh, the two top water peacocks were, were caught on this lure, on this lure, sorry, and and this one with the lipless jerk bait. Alright you guys, so that's your simple mod. You're gonna have to do a little modification to this lure to the Rebel two and a half inch minnow. It's, it's pretty simple. And then right out of the package, you know your two inch teeny teeny poppers would do. Well, I'm gonna do uh, the modification I, I typically do to this lure, but this is gonna be the simple mod. This is your 2.5, 2.5 inch Rebel Minnow. Careful with the hooks. I recommend you can remove at least this front hook before attempting this. But typically, you're just going to grab the lure and just start bending the bill. You can pull it right out, but what happens sometimes the hook will get caught in the little groove right here. So I like to leave the, the broken piece in the lure. This will break off pretty simple. Pretty easily. There you go. I'm just going to have a little, bit, couple little corners left. You can get rid of that with a razor blade or a, a knife. there um, you can change out the hooks if you want to you know do it a little bit you know go further with the mod and once you do that you're just gonna you, this split ring is no no longer needed because the, the lure is not going to be diving down anymore so you could re just remove that and that's it that's your simple mod for a top water lure great for peacock bass Right there, yeah, baby. First cast at the spot, just put up here. Oh, a couple of peacocks, a little one here.
double hook set, folks. Put a pretty good fight. Try to take me off that drop off. Got him on that same lure, the simple mod. We got a little more advanced mod here though. The paint job and the single hooks, plus the book tail. There you go. With the drone. Oh, peacock too. Woo. With the drone. with the drone. fish there. Oh. Whoa. Oh, damn it. All right. Let me tell you what just happened there. All right, well, my encyclic came up and hit the lure. And I was just waiting for the mines to come back and a peacock showed up and it was gone. Alright guys, turns out that the peacock is actually on the bed and the one that just hit the lure. I don't know if he came up wanting to eat the lure or just chase it away. But it looks to me like he wanted to eat it. He's probably just hungry. Anyway, let's go get him real quick on the countdown. Two inch countdown. And there comes this guy. All right, gonna... All right, switch it up to the regular jerk bait. This one has the lip. Still using the bucktail. Get the double hooks in again. Okay. 
All right, right there. Something small. Probably another little bass. Oh my God, look, a bluegill. <laughs> Alright, that feels like a Mayan cichlid there, folks. That's back to back, too. Oh, yeah. I'm turning them on now with the, the jerk beat. I'm probably hooked it a bit. Right there, right there, right there, little mine. All right, you guys. I fished this area with the lipless jerk bait. Didn't get anything. I thought I switched to the to the regular jerk bait with the lip. It did pretty good.